In this video, we will introduce a configuration detection system for a freeform modular robot called FreeBot. A magnetic sensor array and graph convolutional network-based localization algorithm is applied to locate the connection points of other connected FreeBots. MSRR, Modular Self-Reconfigurable Robot is a multi-robot system, composed of many repeated modules, which can rearrange the system into different configurations by changing the connection relationship. In our previous work, we present a free-form MSRR called FreeBot. The free bot can move independently, connect, disconnect from other free bot, and move on other free bot freely. To realize automatic reconfiguration, a configuration detection system without external sensors is needed as the feedback for reconfiguration control. The system needs to locate all connection points accurately through a 0.5 mm thick low carbon steel spherical shell. Limited by the free movement of the internal vehicle and shielding property of steel, most modern sensors can hardly be applied in the free bot. The magnet inside the free bot provides a strong magnetic force, and the steel shell cannot block such a strong signal when the free bots are connected. A magnetic localization system has the potential to detect the free bot configuration accurately. The permanent magnet localization method has been widely studied in the past decades, which is very popular for biomedical applications. Many model-based localization algorithms have been proposed to tracking multiple permanent magnets, but these algorithms rely on an accurate magnet model. Ferromagnetic materials such as the steel spherical shell in FreeBot can heavily change the magnetic field distribution, and the traditional magnet models fail. Some data-driven magnetic localization algorithms have showed good performance in locating single target. We hope to locate multiple magnets by data-driven algorithm under ferromagnetic environments. A FreeBot contains a steel spherical shell and an internal magnet. A FreeBot can connect to other FreeBot by moving internal magnet and attaching to the steel spherical shell of other FreeBot. A symmetric magnetic sensor array consists of 24 magnetic sensors as designed to monitor the magnetic fields produced by the external magnets. To locate the connected external magnets free from time-dependent steel remnants, the magnetic sensors are placed close to the steel shell. Next, we talk about the graph convolutional network-based magnetic localization algorithm. We aim to locate multiple connection points with only single connection point data. The localization problem is modeled as a classification task. The upper hemisphere is split into 18 large regions, and the lower hemisphere except for the region near the internal magnet is split into 12 large regions. There is a magnetic sensor right below each large region except for the narrow space around two wheels. Each large region in the upper hemisphere is future split into four subregions, and the regions at the lower hemisphere contain only one subregion. There are 84 uniform subregions in total when collecting data. The magnetic sensor array can be viewed as a graph, and each node is a magnetic sensor. Six virtual nodes are added near the wheels. For each node, an aggregator is used to aggregate the magnetic data from neighbors and generates an embedding. Then the embedding goes through a multi-layer perceptron, which estimates the labels. In the end, the classification results are merged based in the principle that two adjacent regions cannot be connected simultaneously. When more than two regions that share the same vertex detect a connection point simultaneously, the connection point is near the vertex. In this way, the narrow areas around each edge and vertex can be regarded as new subregions, and 111 boundary subregions can be created. Finally, the whole steel spherical shell contains 199 non-uniform subregions, and the proposed localization algorithm can estimate the non-uniform region IDs of all connection points. We use a simple way to collect the data with relatively low precision, which can meet our basic localization requirements. The region divide lines of the 84 subregions are manually painted on the steel spherical shells, which helps identify the subregion ID. Then the internal vehicle is placed in the lower hemisphere, and the region divide lines are aligned with the magnetic sensors manually. After aligning and fixing the upper hemisphere with the lower hemisphere, we can start collecting data. Another free bot is connected to this free bot and controlled carefully to move inside each subregion in turn manually. Batches of data are collected with different order and magnetization history in this way. Due to the manual alignment error and the manual control error, the dataset is rough and may cause little region boundary shifting. The network parameters can be shared for the symmetric nodes, and we have nine groups of parameters during the training. Here are the training accuracy, validation accuracy, subregion classification validation accuracy, and grouping information. The subregion accuracy represents the accuracy of estimating the subregion id when there exists a connection point. Datasets contain some mislabeled samples caused by human error, which limits the training and validation accuracy. The boundaries of large regions and subregions are slightly shifted as training dataset distribution, which mainly decreases validation accuracy. With the region merging algorithm, the region boundary can be monitored by multiple networks, which can greatly improve the robustness for the multiple connection points localization. Three connection points localization is evaluated and demonstrated here. Three free bots are connected to a free bot equipped with magnetic sensors, and the three free bots are remotely controlled to change the system configuration. 
The connection point trajectories are manually observed and recorded, which are compared with localization results. The regions are projected to a plane, and the region divide lines are distorted for intuitive visualization. Some observed connection point trajectories and the corresponding localization results of the three connected free bots are sampled and plotted on the plane with different colors. The localization results are discretely distributed on the region edges, vertices, and the center of subregions. For the 34 localization results, 76.5% of points are classified to the closest subregion, while the other points are classified to the second closest subregion. Assume that the sub-region position is at the center of it, and the mean value of the angles between estimated positions and observed positions to the center of the sphere is approximate 6.1 degrees, with a standard deviation of 3.1 degrees. Here, a real-time configuration visualization system is demonstrated. A free bot connect to another free bot, reconfigure, and then disconnect. Four free bots are placed on the table, and one free bot has connected to the free bot equipped with magnetic sensors. The other two free bots connect to the central free bot successively. The free bots reconfigure around the central free bot and then disconnect successively. In summary, we want to summarize our contribution. First, we present the concept of configuration detection for free bot with a magnetic sensor array. Second, we propose a magnetic sensor array arrangement for configuration detection under magnetic hysteresis interference. Third, we propose a graph convolutional network-based multiple connection point localization algorithm under ferromagnetic environments. In future work, an automatic configuration data collection system will be introduced to further improve the system precision and better evaluate the system performance. More free bots will be equipped with a magnetic sensors array, and a distributed free bot configuration detection system can be evaluated. Some other studies such as reconfiguration identification, localization fused with 6-axis IMU, and connection points tracking can also be considered. Thanks for your attention.